Hello there everyone and welcome back to a, another one of our videos with me Dave. This is actually the end of today's video so but I'm still doing it as an intro. So yeah, uh, stay tuned, see what we find and you're watching The Detectives. Right, we've got a target here. It's very quiet, 17. And it's about there, let's have a look. Right, that target, we've got it out. It's a lead piece, possibly some sort of dress weight. Not sure on that, but that's what it is. Well, I didn't decide to film this one because I was having a bit of a uh, trash spell, let's say, but we're on with our first little bag seal still see it's got the mud in it there and there is going to be some nice detail on that but you'll struggle to see it on the cam so you'll see a picture of that now so Jim's just joined me from detector Jim and Paul definitely go and check him out give him a sub and from down here I literally just said to Jim if I can find anything silver on here today I'll be absolutely made up and the next hole I've just dug coming up at 18 it is looking silver you can see the milled edge just about on there but yeah i'm gonna clean that up and take a picture and you'll see that now all right we're slightly moving over to the other side of the field come to this different corner we've got a banging target now 22 digger all day and it's there let's have a look finally got it out that's the item that it was a little bit of decoration on there i'm unsure to exactly what that could be but yeah that's what it is right from down here we just had a target scratchy 14 to 16 coming to the side here it's a button and it's silver definitely silver uh i will try and id the button see where it's from see if there's any more details on there and yeah you'll see it on the screen now well guys, we've just had a signal from down here coming in at 15 and some would even say that this is the key to Jim's heart. <laughs> it's all down here, I didn't film this one because it was very, very trashy surrounding it, but it is a thimble. I think it's pretty modern, but yeah, not a bad find at all. Right, Jim's just called me over. What have you got, mate? Well, well it's a bit of a key weight. It is, look at that. That's a big one. For comparison, and I haven't got small hands, Jim. No, Look at that, half a trade weight. Have to find the other half now. Yeah, well done. Right, I'm onto a coin. No idea what it's going to be yet. I'm sure it's silver. I could be wrong. It's just there, just sticking out of the edge. Hopefully, it's not going to prove me wrong and actually. Ah, look at that, just when you think it's going to be something. Well, it was the right colour, that's for sure. But unfortunately, it's a pewter button. It's next target. Just there, sticking out of the edge of the clod. It's looking like a coin that's been made into a pendant or something. I'm going to see if we can get any detail off that.
There he is, the jammy get. <laughs> you were just saying it was silver as well, yeah. sounded silver. Look at that. Looking like 18... 1880, 1890, it's sixpence silver. That is beautiful. Again, GoPro won't focus, but I'll get Jim to send me a picture and you'll see it on the screen. Now, well done. Well guys, we've done it. We just got a signal from down here. Made up with this one. I would just, honest to God, look at this. Just popping out of the edge here. Silver, that has got to be. And I'm hoping it's going to be a hammered. Oh, it's not. Hang on a minute. What is that? Jim, we've got something uh, rather different here. Sorry, Jim's uh, just come over to look at this. From the back, looking at it like that, you would say possibly a milled silver coin. And to be honest with you, it still very well could be, but until you turn it over and you've got a beautiful picture yeah, yeah, yeah. of a building or a church on there, that is really unusual. Guys, I'm going to clean this up and you'll see that on the screen now. Nice target here. It's coming in 22, 24. Really, really good tone. Loud and it's there. Right guys, I've got it out and I have to say if this is what I think it is, it's an absolute bucket lister for me. Just take a look at this. I really just hope it is. Down here in this hole is what I'm hoping is my first ever bit of Bronze Age. It is. I'm telling you now that has got to be mate. I'm with Jim. Jim, that is looking definitely yeah. axy, isn't it? Yeah. And it's bronze. I'm gonna have to get a bit of research done on this, but you can see where I've clipped it with yeah. the spade there as well. Well, rain's coming down now, really bad. Just had this one come up, it was coming up at 25. Seems to be made of bronze. Is it some sort of badge or? I've no idea what that will be, but yeah, pretty cool. Well, rain still absolutely belting it down and a surface find was double bleeping right on the surface. And if I'm not mistaken, I think that is one of the old little snake buckle type things. I could be wrong, but it's definitely looking that way, isn't it, Jim? So I'll clean that up and you'll see a picture of it now. There's Jim detecting away from down here, right on the surface near enough, couple of inches down. We've had our first half penny. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to date that, but still, it's a coin. Scratchy target coming in here, 16, 17. It's about there. Let's have a look. Well, we got it out, it's just plopped out of there, and it was this. No idea. First thoughts was little bell or a candle holder, candle snuffer. No idea on that. I'll try and clean it up and get it on the screen for you, but I think it's pretty much gone that. Right, guys. Well, unfortunately, that does bring us to the end of today's video. Uh, it's been a good laugh getting out, not the best of all weather, I have to admit, but beggars can't be choosers, eh? So I'm going to be out this weekend, which will be on Sunday, which will be with Gareth from the Dukes of Derbyshire, so stay tuned for that video. I'll be releasing that in the week, and if you've been out, hope you found plenty, and if you're due to go out, the best of luck. Take care, I'll see you soon. Bye.